pin a beetle, you will need a foam board, number three insect pins are larger depending on the size of the insect, and some non-insect straight pins to position the body parts for drying. Pin the beetle through the right side of the elytra. You may have to wiggle the pin or apply some force because the elytra can be very hard. Using your fingers or forceps, push the pin all the way through the insect and check that the pin is perpendicular to the body of the insect. The beetle should be one centimeter from the top of the pin. Next, you use a sharp pointed instrument to move the legs into the desired position. All legs and antennae should be exposed so that they can be seen clearly. This helps with species identification and it is more attractive for museum collections. Please note that the legs should move easily like this, so either use a fresh insect or one that has been in a relaxing box. Next, pin the insect into a piece of thick foam so that the body can rest flat on top of the foam. Using a sharp instrument, adjust the position of the legs and antennae so that they are as symmetrical as possible and so all important features are easily visible. Use straight pins to secure the legs in the correct position. Your end product should look like this. Leave the beetle pinned for one to two weeks or until it is completely dry. Thank you for watching our video on how to pin a beetle.